Do you remember your last trip to Disney World? Because I bet I remember something you don't remember. Mosquitoes. The House of Mouse has declared an all-out war on this blood-sucking insect. And despite the fact that Disney World exists on a swamp, they're somehow winning. Disney uses water, architecture, and landscaping tricks to keep the mosquitoes at bay. They even have a super special spray that only the mosquitoes can smell, but I'll get to that later in the video. First, let's talk about the man behind the magic, William Potter. Before meeting Walt Disney in 1964, Potter had served as governor of the Panama Canal Zone. This area is notorious for mosquitoes, and the canal itself was an engineering marvel. Upon meeting him, Disney hired Potter immediately to help clear the mosquitoes out of the infested swampland that would become Disney World. And Disney didn't want to kill the bugs. He just wanted to evict them from the area. The first trick they used is running water. Mosquitoes need standing water to lay their larvae, and swamps are traditionally filled with that. You'll notice if you go to Disney World that every single body of water is flowing in some way. They also have an extensive drainage ditch system to keep the swamp water flowing away from the park. This may not be as unusual as the spray we're talking about in a minute, but it is still an essential piece of the puzzle. The buildings at Disney World also keep away mosquitoes. Florida is known for its torrential downpours, and Potter designed buildings that wouldn't let any standing water on top of the buildings. Every roof at Disney World is sloped or curved or something to make the water flow off down into those drainage ditches. Even the plants at Disney World are designed to keep water from puddling around them. All the bodies of water at Disney are cleared of lily pads and any other plants that mosquitoes are known to breed at. The water is also filled to the brim with fish called mosquito fish, aptly enough, that will eat the mosquito larva before they hatch. Though I have to wonder, does it count as killing the mosquitoes if you just let the fish do it for you? Hey, by the way, I'd love to see you subscribe. Okay, back to the video. Finally, let's talk about that spray. Disney is constantly spraying for mosquitoes. And at first, I thought this sounded like a health hazard to both people and plants. But then I learned how they do it. Disney actually sprays the mosquitoes with liquid garlic as their repellent. Mosquitoes can't stand that stuff and stay well clear. It also has a pleasant side effect on keeping out the vampires. It must just be a bloodsucker thing. Us humans can't smell it at all in such small amounts. Though if you ever start craving breadsticks next time you're at Disney, now you know why. Disney World owes so much of its success to William Potter. So much so that they have immortalized him with his very own fairy boat in the Magic Kingdom. What a great way to honor such an iconic individual. Special thanks to Christopher Lucas and Megan Jones for their writings on this topic. You can check out their works in the description below. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.